What is that? Los Santos got hit by this massive earthquake, so I went to the beach thinking a tsunami might be coming, and next thing you know it, it just flooded the entire city. That's insane! There's a major earthquake going on in Los Santos right now. I'm stuck inside this store trying to hang on for my dear life! Oh, wow! Okay, I think it is finally over. We gotta go to the beach because there might be a big tsunami coming in after this massive earthquake. Also, most of my viewers aren't actual subscribers, so if you like this video, consider subscribing because you'll really help me out. Damage reports are coming in from all over the city. This was a very, very big earthquake that just struck Los Santos, and like I said, we are concerned about the threat of a potential... Whoa! What was that? Okay, before I got rudely interrupted there, we are concerned of a threat of a potential tsunami here in Los Santos. Let's take a look and see what's going on. Oh, this does not look good. I think we might have a tsunami coming. Look at how much the water has receded. The beach is usually ending right about here somewhere and you can see the water has just receded so much. That is actually one of the signs here that there is a potential tsunami uh, coming. You can see some of the corals that are just like now uh, are on the beach. This would be typically underwater, but you can see how much the water has completely receded. The entire Del Perro Pier there is basically on land now. Whenever the water goes out like that, there's usually a tsunami coming. We can't quite see anything yet, but we gotta start evacuating people here as fast as possible. Stop taking selfies. You gotta get off the beach. There's a tsunami coming. Go! Everybody off the beach. Get off the beach. There's a tsunami coming in. Stop horsing around. There's a tsunami incoming. What are you doing, you crazy idiot? What were you thinking? Okay, get out of the boat. Come on, there's a tsunami coming in. No one is listening to me. Everybody is just mesmerized by how much the water has receded. Why are the tsunami sirens not going off here? I'm gonna check in the lifeguard station, see if maybe we can get those sirens going and then maybe people will finally realize how serious this is. Here's the lifeguard station. Where is everybody? Lifeguard station has been completely abandoned so the lifeguards know what's up. They ran away. I'm gonna go ahead and activate the tsunami warning siren. Go everybody, go! There's a big tsunami coming in! Get off this beach right now! Finally, people are listening to what's happening out here and everybody's trying to get off the beach. Let's go! Clear the beach! No, don't run that way! Head the other way! Head inland! Head to higher ground! You're going the wrong way, you idiot! Jim is canceled! Leave, there's a tsunami coming! Run to Vinewood! Get up higher! Go, go, go! Clear the boardwalk, everybody! Get out of here! Now! Go! You only have a few seconds left! Oh my god, everybody! Run! Run! Oh! Oh! Oh, we are underwater! Oh my god, the entire city has been inundated by the tsunami! Whoa, that's a shark! That's a shark! <laughs> Get me out of here! Oh my god, I gotta hide from the shark! Oh my god, it's right over there! Oh, go this way, go this way! Okay, I don't see it behind me. There it is, it's still after me! Go! Go! <laughs> There's a car just like floating around here, that's crazy. Eat those people instead, shark! Whew, I think I finally lost it. We're here at the police station. Got some police bikes still in the parking lot, but uh, it is all flooded out. Okay, I think I have held my breath long enough. Uh, let's go up. I see the sun, we must be close to the surface. Whoa. Wow, look at this. So basically, if you live downtown somewhere, well, maybe higher than like the 20th floor, you are okay in this thing. Everything else is flooded. There's behind me is what remains of uh, Vespucci Beach, Del Perro Pier. That's all underwater now. Vinewood is okay. That's why I was telling people to head to Vinewood. All right, so I'm gonna make my way here. Oh, hey! We got some people here in the water. You okay there, lady? You all right? You survived the tsunami, the great Los Santos tsunami. Watch out for sharks, by the way. I'm gonna make my way down towards downtown and then to higher ground. Whew. I'm a good swimmer because I just made it downtown. We got the Maze Bank uh, building here right in front of us. 
Uh, here's how it looks like underwater. Uh, yeah, the entire downtown core is uh, out of business. Almost there, the road is going up, so that means we must be getting close here. Already going through a hot week, and I see land finally up ahead. Okay, only a few more feet left to go. I have made it. What remains behind me is just flooded, completely flooded Los Santos. Wow, unbelievable. So I I'm gonna try to get a better sense of the scope of this massive tsunami. I think what we're gonna do is we're gonna continue to head uphill. I, I don't know if there's any other, I mean, clearly there's survivors here. There's still people driving their cars around. Uh, you probably don't wanna go that way because uh, it's all flooded. Okay, I mean, if that's what you wanna do, that's fine. You just drove right into the floodwaters, that stupid idiot. I'm gonna continue to head uphill. I'm thinking we're gonna get to the observatory. They have some telescopes up there that we can actually take a look around and see how bad it is. I finally made it and this guy is right here with his phone taking some pictures. And you can see right over there already, basically everything is flooded south of Vinewood. It's all underwater. Let's take a look through the telescope. Yep, there's the downtown core. That is underwater. We were there earlier. That's the Vespucci or whatever is left of Vespucci in Del Perro area. You can see there are some roofs poking up above water, but for the most part, everything is flooded. If I'm not mistaken, that's the control tower at the Los Santos International Airport. And if you're in the control tower, you made it. Everybody else, uh, probably dead. So there you have it. That's how bad it is. I think I might be the only cop that survived, although hopefully maybe some of the Vinewood uh, PD officers made it. So let's head to the Vinewood PD station. I feel like that station is higher up and that's where probably all of the surviving cops are gonna regroup. I'm going to commandeer one of these vehicles here for police purposes, okay? Coming down Elgin, here is the police station. I see it and yes, it has survived the tsunami. It is above water. Right here, the LSPD Vinewood station is probably the only police station left standing. And wow, you can actually see the water right over there and right over there. Oh my God, look how close this station came to being inundated by the tsunami as well. It's literally the floodwaters are like right over here. Wow, so very, very close here to the Vinewood station, but the Vinewood station has survived and we're gonna go ahead and regroup with some of the officers and figure out what to do next. And that is it for this video, but there is a lot more videos for you to enjoy, so don't go anywhere and I will see you on the next one. Bye.